Good morning. It's seven in the morning right now. Tomo's not here. He went outside. Maybe he went to go throw out the trash? We now go live to your cell phone for the messages sent during your captivity. Rose? What are you doing? Are you a reporter? I mean, clearly, he thinks he's a reporter. He just got real bored hanging out with us, I guess. Yes, you got it. I'm copying the people on TV. I just thought it might be funny. You must be really bored. I see. Uh, uh, okay. Whatever. Whatever you want. Thanks for your cold reaction. But it seems like you've recovered to the point of being able to sass me like that. Although, it also seems like you still can see me clearly. Anyway, let's check your messages. We need to hurry before Tomo gets back. New messages. You have 23 messages? Man, well, you haven't checked in a while, so... The battery's low, too. We should check the ones that are important, at least. You've got a lot from Shen, but most are ones from the 17th that are probably just asking where you are. You also have a few from Sawa. It says, what's up? I'm bored. I'm, she must be just a friend. Hmm. Doesn't seem like we can get any info out of these. Hmm. This one it was sent from Inky. You don't seem to be doing well. I'm worried. I wanted to visit you, but Rika said that it would be unfair. I'm sorry. It's not like I don't want to intrude on a girl. She's like all up in her bed and such. I just hope that things are going well with you and that dude you like. Oh well. Okay, so Inky, not our actual boyfriend. This is. Wait, wait a second! Then, uh, does that mean that Inky isn't someone you had one sided feelings for? From the messages, it seems like he was just giving you advice, and his girlfriend's name is Rika. And that means, if you ask Inky, you might actually fan find out who you had feelings for. Wait, then Shin might be good for that. You were talking to Shin, too. It doesn't matter if you ask Shin or Inky. Just, like, send a message and ask him what it's all about. Oh, but if it takes that all your memories come back, you won't be able to talk to me anymore. And that's a pretty important thing right now. Do you... do you want to remember who you liked? Or do you not want to? Or do you already have a guess? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we like Tomo. I'm like, 99% sure. I see. So that's the conclusion you came to? To be honest, I was kind of suspecting that too. But I wouldn't have minded if it proven to be false. I, f I feel you. I feel you, Orion. After all that crap he's done. I mean, it's Tomo we're talking about. He's a guy who does things like this. There's no way I could leave you with a guy like Tomo. I do not trust him. It's possible that the previous you liked him.
But isn't that because you didn't know that Tomo w was a guy that was capable of doing things like this? Hmm. But if that's how you feel, I mean, you can't avoid the subject forever. Setting the past aside, you know a hidden side of Tomo now, and you're still able to say that. Let's try sending a message. You need to ask who you had feelings for before. Wait, what? No way the battery died. Uh, why? Why now? Oh, damn it. Listen, why are we going to send a text about who we liked? I think it would have been beneficial to say, like, get us out of here. This is bad. Hide the phone. Tomo's back. I'm back. Huh? You're up. You sure woke up pretty early. Here's a gift for you. More stuffed animals. Canned juice. You really liked that brand of tea, right? I bought it on the way back from throwing out the trash. <sighs> My hand hurt. My hands hurt. It's pretty heavy. I shouldn't put off taking out for so long. I guess I should clean up my own place once in a while. Hmm. Tomo likes you, right? I don't think there's any mistaking that. Despite how warped that love might be. Are you done? Hey, your hair is still wet. You could have used a dryer. Alright, going back. You'll get cold if you don't get dressed, right? Hmm? What is it? I know you don't want to go back, but wouldn't it be best if you went back to somewhere I where I couldn't see you? Oh, if you said, okay, gotcha. Sorry, took me a minute. Do you like me? Do you hate me? Well, do, do, do you? You like me? Oh, what? <laughs> Got him. Why would you ask that? And why would it even matter? Touch his cheek, silent gaze. Touch his cheek throw them all off. Discombobulate them. What, what are you doing? Stop it. Are you flirting with me? Or is this just a feeling of pity? For pity flirting? You should only do this with the man you like. Don't do it to me. Oh my god. Jesus. Or I'll start to believe that you might forgive me. I... I don't have the right to your touch. Or even to tell you my feelings. I don't even have the right to have dreams or hopes. Let me check. Do I feel bad for you? 